Mina, come on, why? Jesus freaking gamer here. Coming at you with Psalm 69, and I'm just going to start with verse 1. Let's go. Save me, O God, for the waters have come up to my neck. I sink in deep mire where there is no standing. I have come into deep waters where the floods overflow me. I am weary with my crying. My throat is dry. My eyes fail while I wait for my God. Those who hate me without a cause are more than the hairs of my head. They are mighty who would destroy me, being my enemies wrongfully. Though I have stolen nothing, I still must restore it. At this point, we've gone over a lot of psalms that deal with pain, depression, um, threats, death, um, hurt. We've gone through all that stuff. We've gone through it a lot. We've seen that this theme occur over and over and over in the Psalms. And David wrote quite a few of them. And certainly he was no stranger to pain or the problems of this life. I, don't know, I was just reading this Psalm today and I was like, this is a lot. I have read a lot of these Psalms on my journey through the Bible and through the Psalms this time. I'm just like, this is a lot of sorrow. This is a lot of pain. And I'm not going to say, you know, suck it up or get over it. I would not say that. I mean, if he needs help, he should cry out to the Lord for it. And that's when it hit me. Bad times come often in this life. A lot of people have more bad days than good. I've certainly had my fair share. Thankfully, um, in recent years, a lot of my days have been good. A lot of times have been good. But certainly I've had times in my life that were not. Like, the, there was an entire season that was just bad. And I'm sure I'll have more. I have no doubt I'll have more before my journey in this life is up. And that's kind of the point. It will happen over and over and over and over and over and over and over until you're sick and tired of it, until it becomes a drone and monotonous like what I was just doing, and you just want it to stop. And it won't, because it keeps going. And I won't say it. I won't say it anymore for the sake of this video. You certainly get the point. And that's where it's like, you know, yeah, just cry out to God again and again and again and again, and keep crying out to Him until the problem is solved, until your prayers are answered. Keep crying out to Him until the thing is fixed. And when it breaks again. Call out to him again. When sadness comes over you again, call out to him again. When it's another bad day, pray to him one more time. Keep it coming and keep it going. Even when you're sick of it, keep it going. Just you being sick of it, just you hating it, just you cursing it isn't going to get rid of it. Take it to the Lord and fight and stand up. Don't give up. Don't give in. Don't run away. That's not going to solve the problem. Keep going to the Lord. Keep asking for His help. Keep receiving grace and peace and even some joy in the middle of those hard times from your Savior, Jesus Christ. Call out to Him for His help, and He will get you through it. He will bring deliverance. This, that, the end of that psalm is a good end. There's good stuff at the end for God's children. So just keep on plugging away and just keep crying out to God as many times as you need to. I'm sure I'm going to run into more um, sad psalms. I'm, going to I'm sure I'm going to run into more sad times in this life. I'm sure you are too. So keep going to God. Don't give up. Don't run away. Keep praying. Keep pushing. And you will get through. May not be the end you desire. May not be exactly what you thought was going to happen. But God will see you through to the end. He's right there beside you if you're his son or his daughter. So take heart, be courageous, be strong, and don't be afraid. You've heard that saying before, right? Well, you're going to hear it one more time. Sometimes we need to pray again. Sometimes we need to hear that encouragement again. And sometimes we need to do it again. So let that be the encouraging word to you with a smile from me to you and from the heart of God to you, again. Thank you guys very much for watching this video. I love you, and God bless.